Getting your organization started with Yammer is simple. Complete the network configuration tasks in the Yammer Admin Center to have the most consistent experience for your users. As your network matures and the needs of your communities change, you can adjust these network settings as necessary. You can further customize your network with administrative tasks like setting policies around community creation, user management, and who can access content. Let's start with a few of the highlights in the Admin Center in Yammer to get you started. As members join your Yammer network, you can require Yammer users to accept your usage policy. Your Yammer usage policy should be similar to what is allowed on other digital tools. Some organizations provide a list of acceptable and prohibited behavior to ensure that communities stay professional and successful. HTML links can be included within the usage policy so that you can link to additional policy information or Yammer training resources. To make your users feel welcomed, you can add a logo to customize the email notifications sent to members. As conversations start to happen on the network, someone may spot an inappropriate conversation or reply and need to alert an admin. For users to report the conversation on any message, you need to establish an admin who will receive these reported threads. You can do this in the Network Admin panel under Settings, Content, and Security. Additionally, as your network grows, there may be communities that you want to mute. Muted communities are still active, and everyone can still participate in discussions, but non-members will no longer see the discussions in their feed and discovery emails. We encourage you to think through the way your organization may use Yammer, and then you can make decisions about the way you administer it. As a network admin, you can work with different teams at your organization to customize all company to fit the needs and culture of your business. If you want to control the types of conversations that take place in the All Company feed, you can set All Company to Restricted. When this setting is enabled, only admins can post in All Company, but employees can still reply to a conversation and or react to it. You can take it a step further by closing a conversation if needed. You can also customize All Company like any other Yammer community, like editing All Company name, description, avatar, and cover photo. Communicators can use this space as an opportunity for branding and awareness for upcoming events or campaigns. Many organizations use all company announcements to share important and mission-critical information to everyone in the company. Announcements sent to the all company community are sent to all users' Yammer inboxes and to their email addresses as interactive conversations so users can seamlessly stay connected and join the discussion. Users with the Communities app for Teams installed will also receive these notifications directly within Microsoft Teams. You can use Yammer all company announcements to send broad announcements and reach members wherever they work at scale. If your organization has deployed Microsoft Teams, a great way to encourage Yammer adoption is by pinning the Yammer Communities app for all users through custom policies. Admins can pin the Yammer Communities app to the left side of Microsoft Teams, enabling the users to engage with leaders, watch live events, ask questions, get answers, and stay up to date with news and announcements. The Communities app brings the full Yammer experience directly into Teams. Additionally, by using the Communities app, users will get notifications in the Teams activity feed and can stay connected to their communities from web, desktop, and mobile. With some network configurations, the members will understand the rules of engagement for Yammer. This provides a foundation for the network to start engaging in conversations, connecting with others, and sharing knowledge. Continue to think through the way your organization may use Yammer, and then make decisions about the way it is administered.